Well, yeah, I did, but she's a tough nut. I like the tuxedo. It's a rental, but I've had it for 15 years. All right. Well, yeah, I did, but she's a tough nut. I like the tuxedo. It's a rental, but I've had it for 15 years. All right. Well, yeah, I did, but she's a tough nut. But she's a tough nut. But she's a tough, but she's a tough nut. Yeah, you guys did great, but she's a tough nut. And then there is a butt there. But she's a tough nut. <laughs> I like the tuxedo. Now it gets tough. And now it's context. So we can see the situation and you can kind of see Kramer. And this is what he says. I like the tuxedo. I like the tuxedo. I like the tuxedo. And I'll say it. How do you like? How do you like? How do you like? How do you like the tuxedo? 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 Very tough to hear. I understand. Yeah, that's a tough one. If you miss this one, no problem. Don't worry. That's why we say, if you can say it, you can hear it. Now, proper pronunciation, how do you like the tuxedo? That's beautiful English. But in real life, how do you like the tuxedo? How do you like the tuxedo? How do you like? And how do you like is really common. Okay, so practice. How do you like? Ha. It's not how, it's ha. We know the daily pronunciation of how is ha. How do you? It's going to be a schwa. It's going to be a schwa. How do you? How do you? How do you? How do you like? How do you like? How do you like the tuxedo? How do you like the tuxedo? How do you like the tuxedo? It's a rental. It's a rental. We should keep the T, but we can cancel the T because of the N. I like the tuxedo. It's a rental, but I've had it. It's a rental, but it's a rental, but it's a rental, but. Yeah, so if I give you the answer, it should be easy. But yeah, it's tough. I understand. It's a rental. It's a rental. Do you know what I mean by a rental? Yeah, we'll talk about this tomorrow. Uh, a rental, okay? It's a rental. It's a rental, but I've had it. Listen to the pronunciation. It's a rental, but I've had it for 15 years. It's a rental, but I've had it for 15 years. It's a rental, but I've had it for 15 years. Now, here we actually kept the V sound, even though there's a consonant. Remember up here, we canceled it because there's a consonant. It was gone. But here we actually kept it. And it's what's happening is, is we have another cancellation rule called the seven H's. Now, I'm giving you lots of cancellation rules, but actually, they're very few. There's only a couple. But they come up all the time. The seven H's, he, her, him, his, had, has, have. And these words, typically, in the middle of a sentence, that H gets canceled. So what happens here is this V actually runs into the H, and it almost sounds like an F. It's a rental, but I've had it for 15 years. It's a rental, but I've had it for 15 years. But I've had it for 15 years. But I've had it for 15 years. But I've had it. 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 So we have a flap T there. But I've had it for 15 years. And I want you to notice the pronunciation of this word. But I've had it for 15 years. But I've had it for 15 years. But I've had it for 15 years. Does he say four? But I've had it for 15 years. But I've had it for 15 years. No, he says fur, fur, fur. It's a schwa R. But I've had it for 15 years. But I've had it for 15 years. 15 years. Now, we can just write 15. Uh, I spelt it out just to, for fun here. But I've had it for 15 years. All right. All right. Now, this is uh, that LR blending. So we're hearing more of an ah, ah, ah. All right. All right. But I've had it for 15 years. All right. All right. All right. I've had it for 15 years. All right. Well, yeah, I did. I took you back. But she's a tough nut. She's very stubborn. She would not take you back. How do you like the tuxedo? It's a rental. Okay, I just rented it. It's not, you know, expensive. It's a rental, but I've had it for 15 years. <laughs> now, usually, if you rent a tuxedo, you can have it for like a week. Maybe, maybe two weeks if you have two events. Maybe just a couple days. The longer you rent something, the more expensive it is. So his tuxedo is 15 years late. But, so that's a problem because he probably owes a lot of money. Um, but what's impressive is, think about that. Something that you bought 15 years ago, 
Does it still fit? And we have to think about their ages. Kramer is, you know, 35-ish. I'm guessing 35. So he got the tuxedo when he was 20. So when you were 20 years old and when you're 35 years old, can you wear the same clothes? I can't. I couldn't. That's impressive. Well, yeah, I did, but she's a tough nut. <laughs> I like the tuxedo. It's a rental, but I've had it for 15 years. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, I did, but she's a tough nut. <laughs> I like the tuxedo. It's a rental, but I've had it for 15 years. <laughs> All right.